Hey guys, it's Abby, and today I have the Ipsy Open Studios. Now, my Ipsy Open Studios box is quite messy. I'm not really sure what happened. It looked like it got in a fight. This is the Ipsy Open Studios right here. Ipsy is a beauty subscription. They have three subscriptions. They have they have the Ipsy Glam Bag, which is $13 a month, and it, you get five sample size products, and you get to choose one product for that bag. They have the Ipsy Plus, which is, I believe, $28, and you get five full-size products, and you can pick three of those products. And then they have the Ipsy X, which this month is an Ipsy X month, and you pay $55 for that box, and you get to choose, I believe it's three products that go in that one as well, and you get eight to nine full-size products. They do collabs. Like this month, they're collabing with Huda, Huda Beauty, and then um, they collab with like other influencers or beauty influencers for their boxes and they've been pretty good so I'm very excited for my my Ipsy X this month like super excited so let's open it up even though it's already open like it's just open see it says give the gift of Ipsy okay this month the theme is be the main character command the spotlight from your castle or couch with royalty gorgeous looks no with royally gorgeous looks that'll have them bowing down to your beauty your glam bag and glam bag plus are packed with products to inspire you all right so i did get some ipsy refreshments and i have the superb strengthening shampoo and conditioner i have not used these yet it helps revitalize damaged hair and helps prevent breakage from heat styling it's vegan and free of paratins paratins <laughs> no it's free of parabens phthalates and sulfates formulated without gluten and nut allergens our skin friendly products are cruelty free and clinically allergy and dermatologist tested so, and they say, apply a dollop to your wet hair. Do a dollop a daisy. <laughs> you know that, the sour cream? Dollop a daisy. Pro no, okay. Doesn't sound like that at all. Okay, I also got this, and this is the Dazzling Five Blade Razor. Glide gracef gracefully over curves and make way for smooth. Five blades with a soothing strip for an extra close shave. Weighted handle alleviates... Nope. Elevates blades, preventing slime. Inverted storage design to keep the blades fresh and dry. All right. Maybe this is what was damaged. Eh. <laughs> um... I think someone went through my bag. I'm just going to be honest with you. I mean, my box. I'm just going to be honest with you guys. Because I don't think that Ipsy's going to send me an open razor blade box without the product in there. It's open studios. This is like they send this to me for review. And they're, gonna, they're not going to send me open products and empty products. They're just, they just won't. Um, they want it to look good for you guys because I'm reviewing it so people buy it. So I definitely think somebody went through my thing that is so weird you guys this only happens to me like honestly I have the worst luck when it comes to subscription boxes where if this was two years ago and I opened this I'd be making a huge deal out of it and being like oh my god it's empty where'd it go this stuff happens to me all the time like I'm missing products I get broken products I mean it's something that happens too many times to even count so I'm not surprised will I am I I'm disappointed that I didn't get the razor and the blades, but I'm not surprised in the least because this shit happens to me all the time. It's quite annoying. Okay, so let's do the Ipsy bag this month. What? I don't know. I only have this bag. I don't have the Ipsy Plus bag at all. Did I drop it? No. Okay, so I don't know what the Ipsy Plus bag looks like, and that's usually a drawstring bag, but this is what the glam bag looks like, and I like it a lot. I love the color green. I like that it has a gold zipper with a outline of red. I think that's really pretty. It has the Ipsy logo right here, and um, 
yeah, this is a really great, I love this bag. I will definitely reuse it. Maybe I'll stick it in my purse. I think it's really pretty. It's my favorite color green. Um, and okay, so let's see what's in here. I am like so confused on this box because the razors threw me off and then the bag isn't in there. So it looks like all my products are though. Okay, so the first thing I'm pulling out is the Mint Mud Deep Pore Detox Mask. And it looks like this. It says a power packed clay mask that unclogs pores, balances oil and smooth skin. Okay. I, I like getting masks like this. I am not huge on sheet masks that I, I can't sit still long enough for them, but this is a very small little baby, but it says it's mint. So I'm kind of excited that it, that it's mint. Oh, it does. It smells like mint. I love mint. Do any of you guys love mint? I love mint. I want to eat mint all the time. I love to smell like mint. I just love the scent of mint. Spearmint. Love it. Okay, the next thing is this, and this is the Sophia Ma Sophia Maybell. I was going to say Mabel. Mabel. Um, Sophia Maybell. And this is, oh, a tinted lip oil. Here it is. It's really pretty. And the shade is Jellyfish. Jellyfish? I don't think it has a scent. It's got a very long doe foot applicator. And it's just a lip oil. Oh, it feels nice. It kind of feels like a gloss rather than a lip oil. I know you can't see it because it's clear, but I'm excited. I think it's pretty. Okay, then we have the Glossier or Glossier, which one? Milky Jelly Cleanser. It's a conditioning face wash. I'm very excited for this. Massage cleanser on dry or damp skin and rinse thoroughly. Okay. I love getting face cleansers. I love their packaging, it's so clean. Like it's just clean and to the point, you know? Okay, then we have the Briogeo Don't Despair Repair Deep Conditioning Hair Mask. This was the first product I've ever received from Briogeo. The first time I ever received a product from Briogeo in any subscription was this hair mask, and it's still my favorite one to date. Like, I've never found another one that I like as much as the as this one. It just, it smells really good. It leaves my hair feeling really good. Like I just dyed my hair and my hair feels really flat right now. But when I use this, it will give it that fullness and it will be really soft. I love it. Okay, then we have the Able Skincare London Ultra Collagen Eye Rescue. This is actually a really big size for an eye cream to be in here. So we have this, and I love getting eye creams. Love it. Okay, so for the month of November 2021, in your Ipsy Glam bag, you could get the Able Skincare Eye Serum, the Briogeo Don't Despair Repair Deep Conditioner for your hair, and this is a really nice size. This will last you, this could give you at least, if you don't have like super long hair, you can probably get five little maybe four, four conditionings out of that. Um, we got the Kinship Mint Mud Face Mask, the Glossier, what is this again? Milky Jelly Cleanser, and then we got the Sophia and Maybell Lip Jelly, no, lip, oh, it's a jelly, it's jellyfish. It's a lip tint, lip oil tint right here. I do wish there was a maybe like one more makeup product rather than all skincare because we only got this one and then four skincare. So I do wish that they would have put more makeup in there. But again, this isn't my subscription that I chose for this month. I do purchase Ipsy on my own and um, I like getting more makeup than skincare. But again, I didn't pick these products, so I'm not mad at it. Okay, then for the Ipsy Glam Bag Plus, I don't know what the, let me see if I can find the Ipsy Glam Bag Plus bag for this month. Yeah, that is super cute. Oh, I wish I would have gotten that. There it is. It's navy blue. And it's got little gold. It's got a gold crown heart and star on there. You guys, isn't that super cute? I would have loved that. So, okay, so we got that. That's, I mean, we didn't, but that's what the bag looks like. This is the Seraphine Botanicals Camelina. Camelina? <laughs> Maybe it's not came. 
and strobe luminizing primer you guys i love this company's primers i mean i can't like vouch for this one but i got one it's a jelly primer and it is one of my favorite primers i've ever used it is so freaking amazing so i'm so excited to try this and their packaging is just so darn cute that bag was so cute wasn't it it's a good month for their bags Okay, so here is the primer, and it's a luminizing primer, and it's to hydrate. Look how cute that is. Isn't the packaging adorable? Look at the cute little flowers. And that's a really nice size primer. Ooh. Let me see. The one primer I have is like tinted pink, but oh, no. This is a nice thick primer. So see, it looks like that. The primer I have is like a jelly, clear jelly, like a clear pink jelly. <laughs> clear jelly, clear jelly. And it doesn't have a scent. And this is cruelty and vegan free. Okay, no, vegan and cruelty free. Is that what, how do you say that? Vegan and cruelty free, yes. Then I have this, and I think these are scrunchies. Yes, these are scrunchies. We got all different shades of nude. We've got dark brown, brown, and then we have the lighter brown right there. They're cute. I mean, I wouldn't have chosen this as one of my products for my box, but I'm not mad at getting this. And I do have two daughters, and they will use the crap out of that. Okay, the next thing is this. And this is the Liquid Lash Extension Mascara, length, volume, Orchid Stem Cell Complex by Thrive Cosmetics. I don't know if I have this mascara, but if I do, I'm not a super fan. I'm, I, I'm just not. A lot of, oh, I think I do have this. A lot of people love this mascara, and I did at first, but this is a tubular mascara, and it puts like, it coats your lashes in tubes. Um, the, the mascara is like a rubbery, plasticky mascara. So it coats your lashes in like a tube. It's a tubular mascara. So when you go to take it off at night, you use warm water and you just kind of like press downwards on your lashes and it just comes off. A lot of people say it looks like spider legs and it does when it's all over your face, but it just comes off in really nicely in tubes. My issue with this mascara is that it, it gets all over your face. Like I feel like it, I have so much... Uh, flakage on my face when I wear this mascara and then I started using it as a comb through because the wand is so small and it's really good at taking out little clumps of your mascara but I noticed the same thing so then I was like okay well it's clump it's it's falling on my face so much when I'm have my makeup on I'll only use it on the bottom lashes and still the same thing so it drove me nuts so I'm not a huge fan of this mascara at all but a lot of people love it Okay, the next thing is this, and this is the Il Maquillage Matte Lip Color in the shade Dirty Talk. Really excited about this. If it's the same shade as this, I will love it. Okay, so we have the lipstick. Oh, it's magnetic. I love magnetic packaging. And then here is the, oh, wow. That looks really different. It's very textured. The whole lipstick is textured. It's so pretty. I hope you guys can see that pattern, but on the top, it's very textured. At first, I thought it looked like, you know how a rock looks? Like you can see texture all over a rock. That's what it looks like. Ooh, it's beautiful. I love shades like this. Ooh, gorgeous. Just beautiful. Look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? I will wear this every day. Then the last but not least is this. This is the Nomad Venice Simplin Express. Right here, Golden Age of Travel. Carry on eyeshadow. Okay, so it's an eyeshadow palette. Okay, so here it is. I love this color blue. It's like a very beautiful royal blue. Okay, it's pretty. I really like Nomad eyeshadows. I think they're great. They're creamy. 
They're beautiful. They blend really well. I've never had an issue with them. I probably won't use a blue, but maybe I will. I always say that when I see a blue and then I don't ever use it. I need to stop doing that. I should just use it, you know? Here is the palette. This shade, it looks kind of greenish in the palette, but it's this beautiful green gold. It's stunning. And it's not like, also has a little bit of red in it. It's one of, one of those, um, it's a duochrome. It's beautiful. I will wear the crap out of it. It's kind of like what I'm wearing on my lid right now. Actually, my makeup's kind of like falling off, but hold on, let me see. I added a little bit more. It's kind of just like the color I'm wearing on my lid for the shimmer. It's stunning. But here's the rest of the palette. They all swatched wonderfully. I didn't have any issues swatching any of the shadows. They swatch beautifully and I'm really excited to try this palette. Maybe I'll do a different eye look than I normally do when I grab for this. Who knows? All right, guys. So that was the Ipsy Glam Bag Plus for November 2021. You could possibly get the Nomad Eyeshadow Palette, the Thrive Cosmetics Mascara, the Seraphine Botanicals Primer, the Il Maquillage Lipstick, and these scrunchies right here. I don't think this bag, this box was bad this month at all. I definitely think that if this was my box, I would have been happy with it. Maybe not with the Thrive Cosmetics mascara, but every month you get something that you might not like or might not use. It's just like the luck of the draw. I think that if someone got this box, I'd really like it. And that is it, guys. I am done. That was rude. I just like was like, see ya. So anyway, guys, I thought that it was I thought this month was really good, and I'm excited to see what everyone gets in their bags this month. I'm excited for the X. And that is it for today. I'll make sure to link Ipsy in my description box down below so you can go check it out for yourself. And that is it. I hope you guys are having a really great day. Thanks for hanging out with me. Thanks for being here. I appreciate you guys so, so much. Hopefully my allergies will go away and I will feel much better tomorrow. So hope you guys are doing really good. I love you guys so, so much. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.